Now today, <laughs> today. All right, so we have a 200 watt power inverter by Lithuania. So, awesome, awesome, awesome. 200 watts. Now this is a double pack of inverters, which is really cool because a lot of people have DeWalt tools and this runs on the DeWalt style batteries. Very cool. So, hence being very affordable because you don't have to buy the batteries as a charger because you already have them. This is tool only. So it brings your cost down, which is awesome for you because you've already have the DeWalt style batteries. Now, let's check these out. Because this is exactly, exactly how you're gonna get it. So, you have a 200 watt Power inverter owner's manual, right there. Now, this is a two pack, which makes it super cool because when you're hiking, when you're biking, uh, if you're on the road, you and your wife, you and your girlfriend, you and your, your kids, your daughter, uh, you can send it off with your sons when they're going somewhere. Uh, very good emergency kits. <laughs> and <laughs> when the power goes out and you have no way to charge your cell phone, uh, or turn on a light, you have 200 watts of power. Now, let me explain the 200 watts. So, you have to be in mind of 200 watts. So this is 200 watts total. So, you have an AC plug-in, you have the US, two USB ports, and then you have a Type-C port. Now, combined or single, you can only do 200 max of power. So you have, say you have 100 watt light bulb and you have uh, two cell phones that charge it, we're gonna go with 50 each. You could do that. But if you put like 200 watts here, like you're charging uh, two laptops or anything like that, uh, then that doesn't give you any power for up here. Now, that includes this light. <laughs> so these will do 200 watts of power total. And when you get to, now you have 400 watts. So, let's talk about this. Um, these are smart inverters. So, what I mean by a smart inverter is it's, it controls when, if it gets too hot, if it overloads, if there's uh, something surging on it. It's a smart one. It'll, sh it'll shut off to save the unit, to save your parts, to save your wiring. Very safe. Um, that's a very good plus. Now... Uh, these are the 20 volt dual style batteries. It's got safeguards of Yaya over protection, short circuit protection, cooling protection. It cools through here and it blows the hot air out here to keep the unit cool. So very good, very smart. Um, and yes, did I say they're there by Lithuania? <laughs> uh, it says uh, running watts 200, DC input uh, 18 volts slash 20 volts. So it could take 18 or 20. Uh, your AC input or output is going to be 110 to 220 or one, 110 to 120. Uh, your USB is 5 volts at 2.1 amps. So just be in mind what you're what you're running, and you shouldn't have a problem. These are very good in emergencies. So let's set that right there for the meantime. Now you can use the regular Dewalt batteries. They clip in fine just like so, and then um, you can power up the unit. And when you power up the unit, it you can tell it's on by this green light. So that means it's ready to go. Now, it also has uh, your light setting right here that has 100, 75, and 50%. Uh, so say you need more power here, but you still need lights, you can cut down, there's 100, there's 50 and there's 75 and then it goes back to nothing. So you can tell they're protected and what you're running. So if you're running a little bit hot here, you gotta turn down the, uh, the flashlight. Now on the flashlights themselves, uh, you can turn up, you can turn down. So any way you're holding it, you can hold it kind of like this, you can hold it like this, you can hold it like this, anything that's comfortable they got you covered with the swivel light and they're LEDs so they're gonna last a long time so we got that covered now I <laughs> I like power especially 
uh, since we've been through tornadoes and frost storms and all kinds of stuff in the last couple years, um, I want power. So I have a lot, a lot of these, uh, the, the generic type lithium ion DeWalt style batteries. Now these are the six amp hour that's going to last longer because I'm cheap. <laughs> I'm on a budget all the time. That's why these are awesome. So during a power outage, I have a generator, but until I get everything together, it's usually at the middle of the night when something happens. Um, I need a light and I need some kind of a power that I can plug in, flip it on, and then I can go find what I'm looking for, see what, because I have to do a lot of switches and stuff to get my generator going. And this is a nice first power. <laughs> so I could just find this, plug in a battery, and go look for what I'm doing. So really, really cool. And it gives you the temperature range here at 75 Celsius. And then it gives you the battery right here. So nice little display uh, where your buttons are and, and very informative because let's face it, when you're up in the middle of the night because somebody hits your power line or the power is out or you have some kind of emergency, uh, it's very good to try to understand what you're doing and it's just a quick push button. Now, uh, these will last pretty long on the batteries. It depends on what you're using them for. If you're using it for a, a flashlight or just to light up a bathroom so you can use it, you just turn on and it'll probably last you eight hours because the light doesn't use a lot of electricity because it's the LEDs. Um, nice little lightweight unit. I uh, like I like to have a few of these so I can have them in my car um, because yeah. Now, you're gonna wanna not have these plugged in because if you have them plugged in, they could, you could accidentally hit the button and then drain your battery and when you need them, you can't use them. So always keep them separate. They could be together, but just not plugged in. And these don't discharge, so you always have a fresh battery anytime you need it. And when you're backpacking, you can carry a couple of batteries with you, or if you're camping or doing whatever, these make awesome chargers. Now, let me show you something that's really, really cool, is plug it in, turn it on. Now, this is a 75 watt light, which is really cool. Now I just dragged that out of my shed so I could use it. There, that's 75 watts. Now, see I'm, I'm being in mind what, what I have for my 200 watts. So, on my cell phone. So if I plug this in, and this says it's five volts. Um, so it's probably, let's say, maybe 10 watts. So you can plug that in, and there you go. That's charging. Now, say I'm doing all this and I need a light. <laughs> so you got a lot going on <laughs> just by this little unit. Now, very cool if you're on the job site doing construction because you always need a charger to charge your phone, to charge your laptop, to charge anything. You know, people who do construction know how valuable it is to have a outlet. <laughs> so yeah, you can plug in a lot of stuff. Lights. Um, simple. And there's no gas. So all you're doing is, say you've used your battery and this is dead. Slide on another battery, you're good to go, brand new. <laughs> and then charge this one. So, now they give you two pack, which is really cool. And did I mention? They're by Lithuania. So they do very good products. I've had some of their products in the past and I still use them today. I'm very happy. <laughs> uh, they're out of a nice hardened plastic, which is, you know, if you have the DeWalt tools and stuff and the Makita tools, they have that very sturdy uh, built plastic. So it's got that same plastic on here. And it's got a nice little grip here. So when you're holding it, it's got a good rubber grip. It has what what it, the running watts, the DC, 
the output and all that right here on the back so that you'll never wonder what you can use it. It's, it's 200 watts, the running watts. So there you go. Uh, that's it in a nutshell, and I'll see you guys next time. <laughs>